Hi again, it's your recognition ceremony, and this is Mr. Dodge, and I'm with two parents that I caught helping us get ready for the book fair and book mania next week. And we're learning about being an inquirer for next time or being a risk taker, how to be courageous. So I've asked these parents to come in, and they're going to talk about inquirer and risk taker. So tell us your name, your students, or your children who are at the school, and what does being an inquirer mean to you right now? So I am Kelly Shearer. My children are Alex Shearer in third grade commit class and Samantha in first grade raccoon class. And right now we are new to Panama, so we are inquiring about Panama and the culture and the language. And so that's what we're inquiring about. Thank you. So along that inquiry cycle, or if you're going into the inquiry, what sort of things are you doing or your, is your family doing? So right now I'm taking Spanish language class to be able to speak Spanish better. And also we are exploring Panama, trying to visit all the new places that we can. Thank you very much. A lot to see and a big inquiry there, obviously, for Panama. All right. Thank you. And then the next uh, attribute we're going to be looking at for next month uh, to think about is being a risk taker, which also sometimes sounds like how can you be courageous? So I have found this other mom now, and she's here to help us. Tell us your name, your children at the school, and what does being a risk taker mean to you or being courageous? Well, my name is Alejandra Falcón. Uh, my daughters are Leticia Pucci in kinder and Ada Pucci in third grade. Uh, I think I am a risk taker because uh, my original career is not being a personal trainer. But at some point, I realized um, I had a call there. I go for it, and now I teach a bunch of women and ladies to to feel confident about themselves and um, speak in public and to try try to teach what you know is hard. So I think when I do that, I'm a risk taker. Thank you. Sometimes when you're being a risk taker, courageous, you have to overcome some fears. So. What kind of fears were there for you that you had to overcome or try? Well, the first fear that I have uh, was not having anyone on my class. And, well, eventually I got more and more ladies to come. And also to be able to express what I know, uh, to correct someone, um, to play the right music. That's all uh, part of the d dynamic of a class in my case. And to handle it, sometimes it's hard. But I feel confident on handling better if I didn't do in right the right thing in the right moment. The next day is a new day. So I just start over. Thank you very much. Both of you are being some risk takers by being quickly on camera because I know you're so busy over uh, getting the book mania stuff ready. They're pricing books and getting them in order. So thank you also for your help with that. Yes, book, book mania prep here. I'm also a risk taker because I don't speak as, uh, English as my first language and I'm here speaking to you. I speak Spanish. All right, so uh, this is Mr. Dodge, and I hope you've had a great recognition ceremony. Obviously, you've had two great examples uh, about being an inquirer and being a risk taker, being courageous. So I wish you all the best with that when you think about the next attributes for our next recognition ceremony. Ciao, everybody.